Now, let's move on because the White House has released its plans for planetary defence. So what exactly does this mean and, and what are the key goals of the US in this space? Yeah, so this is a, a result of that successful DART mission, the double asteroid redirection test we saw late last year when a probe crashed into an asteroid and deliberately altered its course. Now, so the question was, uh, A, would it work? And then B, what next? Um, and so NASA and the White House have been working together to say, well, what are going to be our priorities for the next 10 years? And so they said the White House just a few days ago released, what are the six things to focus on? Now, the first two relate to tracking and finding near-Earth objects, or NEOs, as we say. So the idea is, well, we need to be able to find smaller ones. We need to be able to find them further away and where they're going and then better produce, well, not just where are their orbits, but what are they likely to hit or not hit. Um, other key aspects of developing ways of improving the technology to deflect these things, i.e., DART worked, let's build a bigger, better version potentially to see just how effective we can be. But also at the end is what you're seeing is both working with the international community. Right now, NASA has done a lot of this work into finding near-Earth objects and asteroids and the hazardous ones, saying, let's work with our overseas partners to broaden that work. Uh, and also doing simple things like emergency drills, believe it or not. We, they've done a few in the past, NASA, and it showed that if one were to ha hit near the Earth, we wouldn't be as prepared in terms of the agencies, the management, uh, and the practicalities of if an asteroid were to hit the Earth. So that needs to be part of the equation as well. So from finding them, knowing where they're going, trying to solve them, and limiting the damage is part of the plan for the next 10 years.